Good afternoon, everyone. My name is JT from Where to Find. It's been quite a while since I've released an episode, but here we are back again at a new spot called Opiari Cafe. It's a little Japanese cafe located in Richardson, Texas. We're gonna go inside and check it out. Let's go. Okay, so they have these little booths like how they do it in Japan, uh, all the cafes there. And of course, I have to start with my tea set that they gave me. Normally, it would be nice to have another person, but all my friends are busy at work. This is my work, so drinking tea by myself. <sighs> oh, this is good. All right, so now for my favorite part of the show is the eating. First off, we're gonna start with this yakisoba hot doggo. It has a ramen on there. Pieces of chicken, little slices of carrots. Look at that. Ooh. So there's so much food out here. I'm gonna just... Mm. Mm, okay, so the bun, sweet, toasted perfectly. Uh, big hot dog right there. The ramen pairs well with the sausage because it's not overbearing or anything like that. All right, next up we have the omelet rice. Has a demi glaze on there. Uh, omelet rice is a egg omelet over fried rice. Get a little bit of demi glaze on top of there. Mmm, that's actually really good. I had omelet rice at another place. I didn't like it because the sauce was too sweet, but this one. Perfect, savory. Fire rice has carrots in it, you know. Mmm. That's actually really good. Actually, like, one of my favorite dishes so far. Of course, I got the hibiscus matcha lemonade to wash it all down. All right, third up on the list is the katsu hot dog. Put some Japanese mayo on there. Fried, crispy. Let's give it a bite. Sweet, crunchy, different than the yakisoba one. The bun is still sweet and toasted, just like the other one. All right, next up we got the tonkatsu bento box. Has a nice tonkatsu sauce on there. Thin, light batter. Yeah, let's try this. Mmm, that's really the perfect bite. The batter on there is perfect because you get the right amount of porkiness and crispiness. Uh, the batter doesn't overpower the pork like a lot of places. Uh, we get the katsu, and the tonkatsu sauce just gives it the right amount of sweetness. $14, can't beat that. One of my favorite dishes. That was all the food, but can't get over how much I love this omelet rice. I haven't tried the omelet rice in Japan yet, unfortunately, but I guess this is as close as I could get in Dallas. Mm. So good. Now we're on to my favorite part of every meal, dessert. And here we got a matcha affogato. And let's do it. Oh yeah, can't get any better than that. Oh, this vanilla ice cream is so smooth. And can't go wrong with matcha. I love matcha on everything. All right guys, thank you for tuning in on this episode of Where to Find. Subscribe, comment below on any places that you want me to go. See you guys next time.